Hi, I'm Dan Rodriguez. I'm a VP and General Manager of the Communication Infrastructure Division within Intel. And the charter of our team is to work with the overall industry and delivering strong silicon solutions that you can utilize as you transform your overall networks. Well, Intel is introducing a new network academy and it is really a formal training program and the series of classes that you're going to intake on are really geared towards helping you have the right recipe so you can successfully implement network transformation. Earlier this decade the overall industry rallied or started rallying behind a concept called network transformation. This included Intel partnering with the likes of comm service providers, ISVs, OEMs and even SIs. And the idea behind network transformation is to move the market or the network from a series of fixed function or purpose-built appliances to more general purpose servers utilizing cloud technologies such as virtualization. And the idea behind this would enable the comm service providers to have an infinitely more scalable, flexible, and an intelligent network. This would set them up well to not only be able to support many different virtual network functions in a very efficient fashion, but also be able to scale out those compute resources to support all sorts of new use cases in the future, including all sorts of media, including immersive media, analytics, Internet of Things, and even be set up for success uh, in the 5G era. So the reason why comm service providers are looking at transforming their networks are really kind of at a high level, maybe twofold. The first is we continue to see increases amount of traffic across the overall network. And that trend will continue as we're seeing all sorts of new use cases as well as all sorts of new imaginative devices that will connect to the network. The second thing is that as we're going ahead and we're seeing what's going to happen at the later stages of LT and as we prepare for 5G, we're imagining all sorts of new and, and diverse use cases. And all these use cases will have many different requirements. Some use cases will require high bandwidth, some will require low latency, some will require both. Some even, may even require greater levels of privacy or security. So because of this, the, the, the network needs to become much more flexible and scalable to not only handle this increase in traffic, but also be able to scale and be able to support this diversity of use cases. We think back when we first started the journey on network transformation, we really focused really as an industry in transforming the mobile core network to start. And since that time, we've seen a lot of virtualized EPC deployments as well as virtualized IMS deployments, just to name a couple. And now as we look ahead towards the future and we look ahead towards 5G and all those diverse use cases, that I mentioned earlier, uh, the, the, the market is now focused on how do we transform the edge of the, of the network to be able to deliver those services in a way that delivers the right quality of experience for customers, as well as helping them manage the overall traffic. And some of the areas that are truly ripe for transformation include modernizing that central office in a concept called Next Generation CO, as well as modernizing the access network and utilizing concepts such as virtual RAN. Well, of course, our obvious role is we're going to deliver and continue to deliver leading uh, silicon products that really support uh, network transformation. But Intel does so much more than just delivering silicon products. To really ensure network transformation is done in a really open and standard way, we are participating in a broad array of industry standard groups as well as open source projects. In addition to this, we've also hosted and created something called the Intel Network Builders Program, which has the aims of pulling together the right members from the ecosystem, from ISVs, comm service providers, to TEMs, to OEMs, all in the name of pulling together the right solutions to enable uh, this sort of transformation. And finally, Intel is viewed as a trusted technical advisor, so because of this, we've kicked off this formal training program to always provide the overall industry, the right tools and education to drive network transformation. We hope you'll take this opportunity to join us in this training program and partner with Intel and the rest of the ecosystem to drive network transformation. Thank you.